From losing their home in a fire to picking up what is left of their belongings, one Carney family was in need of some help as they figured out their next move. As NTV's Lauren Bentley tells us in tonight's Show Us Something Good, their community jumped in to help in a way they say they still cannot imagine. Jumped up and opened the door and the deck was on fire. Within minutes, one Carney family lost their home. And the fire department declared it a complete loss. Teresa and her son Creighton, who asked not to be on camera, had no choice but to move out and find a place to stay. And then like staying in hotels and you know, you'd think it would be fun, but <laughs> it's not. But they didn't want to leave their home a mess for their community. Their concerns weren't on themselves. Their concerns were how can they how long did they have to clean up this home for the community of Valley View? Lindsay Marshall, community manager of Valley View, says she knew right away that she wanted to help the family. I knew that this family deserved a blessing, and I, something just told me, as the community manager of Valley View, it was my time to come through and do what I could for them. She sent an email to other residents asking them for donations, which continued to pour in through their office. I was overwhelmed, and I can't tell you how many times last week I just had happy, happy tears come down my face to see not only my residents in the community of Valley View come together for their fellow neighbor, I also had local businesses reaching out, offering clothing, any and everything that could help this family. Marshall was even able to get them a new home. And the owner of the company did approve for me to put them in one of the used homes that we have in our community. You're gonna make me cry. Okay. I'm trying not to. Teresa and Creighton say they were shocked when they heard the news. Feels amazing. <laughs> I, I'm not quite sure yet. I, I mean, I see it, <laughs> but I'm still, I'm still in the overwhelmed. And the community here that's helped with what they can, that's, I mean, but I'm still overwhelmed. Everything's, I think, got a process. And fellow neighbors say it's what they would want someone to do for them. You can be kind to someone that you don't know. You can be there for them. The smallest kindness can really change someone's life. I'm blessed to be able to do this for them, and it melts my heart. I feel complete that I was able to help this family through this struggle and devastation of losing not only your home, but everything. Both Teresa and Creighton have a new home and new friends they now consider family. There's still kind people out there that you can count on. Showing you something good. I'm Lauren Bentley.